It's been one of those weeks where Elmo has had it with Rocco, and he's all set with Zoe pretending Rocco is real. Earlier at the playground, Elmo was excited to see that one of the swings was free, but when he ran up to it, Zoe told him he was too late because Rocco was using it. Later on, Elmo wanted to go down the slide at the clubhouse, but Zoe told him that he'd have to wait his turn because Rocco was next in line. And since Rocco can't move, Elmo never got to go down the slide. At Hooper's store, Elmo wanted an ice-cold bottle of soda, but Mr. Hooper said he sold the last one to Rocco. And finally, when he went to a sleepover at Zoe's house, Rocco got the spare bed while Elmo had to sleep on the cold, cold floor in a shadowy corner. So Elmo decided to get even. First, he switched out Rocco for an entirely different rock and made Zoe cry, which made Maria and Susan yell at Elmo for making Zoe cry. And the next time Rocco was in front of Elmo in line, Elmo didn't wait. He just kicked Rocco down the slide, which made Zoe cry again. So Susan and Maria yelled at Elmo again. On a different day, he threw Rocco into the amazing Mumford's hat and then tricked Mumford into making Rocco disappear. And once again, that made Zoe cry. Maria and Susan came over and yelled at, yeah, you get the point. Then one day, somebody started playing pranks on Elmo. First, somebody dumped pink paint all over his new go-kart. Then somebody hung this mean sign on the clubhouse. And finally, someone threw away all Elmo's toys and had the garbage man haul them away to the city dump. Logically, Elmo assumed that Zoe was up to all these evil doings, so he pounced on her, and they started fighting. Yeah, that's the two of them fighting. Get your mind out of the gutter, people. Suddenly, a voice from inside the clubhouse said, Zoe didn't do it. And Elmo was all, yeah, well then who did? It was me. Dorothy, cried Elmo. It was Elmo's pet goldfish, Dorothy. But why, asked Elmo. And Dorothy said, dude, I'm your real, live, actual pet. And for the last few months, while you've been going on vacations and cruises and having all these little adventures, you've been completely ignoring me. And for the last two weeks, all you've been doing is obsessing over this stupid, lifeless rock and planning all these little pranks and schemes. And the whole time, you haven't even fed me. I've been eating all the algae that's growing inside the tank that you're not cleaning. So why don't you stop focusing on that stupid lifeless rock and start focusing on your real pet? So Elmo apologized to Dorothy, and then he apologized to Zoe, but he didn't apologize to Rocco because Rocco doesn't have feelings. And then he turned around to tell Dorothy he was going to take much better care of her. But Dorothy was dead because she's a fish, and fish need water, and she came out of the water to yell at Elmo. So yeah, she died. And then Elmo and Zoe said a prayer and flushed her down the toilet, and she will not be back for the next episode.